everybody. This is Seth and Jacob with Blue Collar Gaming here for round three. Round three. Round three. We're on Corona lockdown. Um, <laughs> still have our hand sanitizer. And poor Jacob. If y'all would, we're, we're collecting a fund for Jacob for some land for his decks. <laughs> so if you have any spare. Apparently 35 lands is not enough today anyway. Yes. So uh, so any uh, so the if you watched our previous videos, um, Jacob was playing a Porphyros, Mono Red, and had three get, lands, had three the lands by the end of it. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, I may have destroyed one of them. Um, and then uh, playing Lazov, uh, Blue Black Demir Mill. We only, couldn't draw an island. Could not get an island to save his life. And, uh, you know, it ended up costing him because I smacked the hell out of him. Uh, <laughs> no remorse here. <laughs> so here right. we are, rematch, round three. Um, I'm still playing Chulane. Teller of Tales, rebuilt brawl deck from Thrones of Eldraine. Going uh, against Demir Mill. So let's draw some cards and so see what what's up. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. Oh, Let's gosh. See. I don't okay. know if I should keep that or not. Mm. I don't think I can. I don't think I can keep that. Ordinarily, I would keep this, but I've been masked <laughs> so bad today. I don't know. Uh, I will. There is so much goodness here. Mm. Mm. Do I want to keep this? I'm putting it back. I'm putting it back. I will try. I will try. try. We'll give Jacob, you know, a chance. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Don't do me any favors. <laughs> Excellent. So, cut me. Cut you. All right. At some point, the shop owner is going to come in and not know what we're doing in his store. Yep. Which is going to be funny. Two, three. No land yet. Four. No. Five. Six. Seven. Any land. No lands. Wow. <laughs> All right, we'll be going down cards now. Uh, okay. So, how long has it been since you've played this deck? A couple weeks. A couple weeks. Because I have found that if I go an extended period and don't play a deck, it's like the deck gets mad at me. Now he's making excuses for me. <laughs> well, you know, I mean, I, it, it sounds silly, but if I don't play a deck regularly, it's like I'm not hitting the land draws. I'm not getting what I need. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. So I'll lay hands on this deck. All right. Uh, All right. Okay. Is, it, is there going to be? All right. How are we looking? It's looking like I'm going to be going back to work. <laughs> uh -oh. Still no lands? There's one. You shuffle it this time, and I'm going to go down to five. All right. shuffle. Are these double-sleeved? Uh, I don't think so. Uh, yeah, they are. They yeah, are. they are. Yeah, okay. they are. I was like, that wow, this is a big deck. Shouldn't be talking about other guys' big decks. <laughs> now you sound gay. <laughs> I don't know that we should put this on the internet anymore. What? Uh. Double sleeving is good, especially if it's a it's a deck that you're rather proud of and you want to protect it. <laughs> protect your decks, everybody. <laughs> He's trying not to lose it. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> you need a moment. Uh, go ahead. All right. <laughs> Let's see what we got. All right. Here you go. All right. Two, 
how are we looking? Six, seven. All right, how many am I putting back? That was the... That was the second. So I need to put two back. So I will So the big two. question is, did you get Lance? We did, we did. So I'm going to put that card back. And bottom or shuffle? Bottom. Okay, all right. Yeah. And just in case the folks at home are wondering, here's what I'm dealing with. So we're going to see if we can't make this work. All right. You go first. All right. I'm going to play a island. An island. Blue Finally. off the bat. Go ahead. All right, let's see. I will play a forest. Go ahead. I'm going to play a drowned catacomb. Ooh, very nice. More blue mana than I've had all day. Yes. <laughs> Go ahead. All right. All right. We will play another forest. And then I will tap it for a Sylvan Karyatid Defender Hexproof. Tap it to add one mana of any color to your mana pool. Excellent. All right. Go ahead. All righty. I'm going to play a swamp. And I will play It's going to do a thing. Chromatic Lantern. Hey, mana has been fixed. All right. No. My mana fixed until yeah. Oko turns it into an elk. Until Oko okay. okay. makes it into an elk. That would make a very lovely elk, I must say. All right. Uh, let's tap the Sylvan. Mm -hmm. I'm going to ponder. Look at the top three cards of my library. And then put them back in. Any order. Okay, and I may shuffle my library. I'm not going to shuffle my library, but I am going to draw a card. Excellent. And then with that, I am going to play a breeding pool untapped. I will take two damage okay. for that, for the pleasure. I'm at 38. And with that three mammas, we'll put out a Dryad of the Islin Grove. Love this card from Theros Beyond Death. Play an additional land on each of your turns. Lands you control are every basic land type in addition to their other types. So it's a chromatic lantern on a dude? Yes. That's it. That is it. All right. Okie dokie, I will play another island. Hey, hey. And I will cast my commander. What? He Let's did a thing. thing. All right, go ahead. All right, we will untap. We will draw. And what does uh, Lazov do? So basically whenever you mill or discard or something gets killed and goes to your graveyard, he can basically turn into that. And he has its uh, abilities and whatnot, except he still has hex proof. Okay, very nice. And is he main still, is he still a 3-3 three, three or? He turns So he becomes a copy of that card. Yes. Okay, interesting. All right, let's see. What do I want to do? I will pay two for a lightning breeze and equip that, or any response to the lightning. And we'll move to equip. And I will pass. 
Okay. I also will pass. All right. There's been lots of blue manas open. I'm just excited to have some. Sylvan Carry to and it gets an additional counter, so it is a two four. The hex proof is different from shroud, you can target it, right? Yes, I can target it, you cannot target it. Yeah, if it was shroud. Yeah, and it's not really uh it, do, it doesn't say target. Okay, cool. All right. It says you may have Spark Double enter the battlefield as a copy of a creature or planeswalker you control. Sweet. All okay. right. And go ahead. All right. Oh, another island. Hey, you are island rich. Island rich. I think that I will. Six. I'm going to cast Tapping all the mana. Will Kenrith. Will Kenrith. And what does Willie Will do? Uh, well, he comes in with four loyalty counters. I can roll them up two. And uh, if everything on your board did not have hexproof, yep. I could slip up to two target creatures and they would have base power and toughness zero, uh, three, and lose all abilities until my next turn. Mm hmm. I can roll them down to draw cards and okay. make my instants and sorceries cheaper. And then his ult basically lets me, uh, whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, copy it. You may choose new targets for the copy. So, I will roll him up. All right. To six. And until my, oh, no, wait, because uh, that's a copy of that. It has hexproof. Yep, hexproof, hexproof, shroud. Well, I will leave him at four then, because uh, I can't roll him up because there's no targets valid, mm -hmm. right? Everything on the board has hexproof. Yes. <laughs> you know my commander. <laughs> Everybody's got hexproof, so. Ain't nobody doing nothing. All right, well, <laughs> on to you, sir. All right. Kind of a weird situation. Yeah, <laughs> kind of a stalemate. All right, let's see what we I will pay two for a mind stone. I like it. I like it. And I hmm. I want to go to attackers, but you've got a three three. I've got a 2-4. There's not a whole lot I can do for that. Go ahead. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to roll Will Kenrith down to 2. Okay. So that I can draw 2 cards. And make my instants and sorceries and planeswalker spells cost two less. Okay. Okay, so I'll draw two. One, Seems good. Two. I will play. Or this game. Nice. Um, and it will be on you. All right. Untap. Draw. And I'm 
I'm going to tap one, two, three, four, five manas to play Urban Evolution to draw three cards and then I can play an additional land. I like it. I like it. And I will pass the turn. Right. Cool. Oh, wow. Did you get something good? Something fun. How many lands do you have tapped? Three. Okay. I'm going to pay two to play Mesmeric Orb. Hang on, what does that do? Whenever a permanent becomes untapped, that permanent's controller puts the top card of his or her library into his or her graveyard. Interesting. Okay. And I will play land for turn. And that also affects you too, doesn't it? It does. Very good. I'm okay with this game. All right, you feeling a little bit better? I know you had a rough go of it the first two matches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got some more mana than I've had in the last two games combined, so that's yes. fun. And you have cards in hand. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, uh, go ahead. All right. So I'm untapping. Four. And it's permanence. Permanence, so lands. Five. And so I'm going to mill five. Yes. One, two, three, four, five. All right, and let me see any creatures that you milled. Maybe right. Lazar can turn into something fun. So we've got Mr. Krabs. Mr. Krabs. Whenever a land enters the battle, can read your control type. Okay, all right. What all else right. you got? Voracious Hydra. Oh, but it's got an X cost, right? Yeah. So okay. he is actually a zero one, and I don't think he'll really do anything for you. Yeah, I can't do anything with him. Um. That is tempting. And that is a. Uh, if you're wondering, Mr. Krabs is Hedron Crab. He is from uh, the Zendikar. Is that Zendikar block? That looks I like think Zendikar. This is Zendikar. Um, and he has he's a zero two crab with landfall. Whenever a land enters the battlefield under your control, target player puts the top three cards of his or her library into his or her graveyard. It is an outstanding card in this deck because of all of the land drops that I can get. Um, so, I think I'm going to pass. I think I'm going to pass. You want to pass on that? Yep. Okay. All right. So, let's see. And then I'm going to draw. Okay. I missed something. Oh, well. I'll play land for turn. I'm going to tap three for Nissa Vastlitzir. Mm. I'm going to go get a basic forest and put it into my hand. I like it. I like it. Basic forest into hand. Now, because I have Dryad of the Ills and Grove, I land. can play an additional land, which I have not done. Okay, so cool. I will play my Dryad land. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> and when does Missa flip? When I have seven or more lands. When a land enters the battlefield under my control, if I control seven or more lands, exile her and then flip her. Would you like to cut me? Excellent. I think I will do that. I will tap four more. Okay. Solid. Oh, she's flipping. So I'll go get a basic land. I'm going to go get a plains because I need white now. Hmm. 
That is my first white producing land before I was producing it with the Sylvan Karyatid and the Spark Double. All right. Now that I have undone your cut, would you like to recut me? <laughs> ah, you're good. All right. And because a land entered the battlefield and I have seven, we will exile Nyssa and flip her. And she will turn into Nyssa the Sage Animus. I like it. I like it. Uh, and so she is a legendary planeswalker. This is from, um, she's originally from the uh, Origins set. Uh, where they had all the flip planeswalkers, but this particular planeswalker actually came from the, uh, the vault, the from the vault uh, flip series. So uh, let's see. So I'm going to plus one her, which is reveal the top card of your library. If it's a land card, put it into the battlefield. Otherwise, put it into my hand. She can minus two to create a legendary four four green elemental creature token named Ashaya. Ashaya named, named what? A S H A Y A, Ashaya. Sure. Okay. The Awoken right. World. Yep. Um, and then minus seven, untap up to six target lands. They become six six elemental creature tokens. They are still lands. Mm. That look. Right. <laughs> uh, we will roll her up to four to reveal the top card of our library. Oh, it shit. is the Kraken. The Kraken. So we may release the Kraken later and make some tentacle monsters. Anything else? I believe that will be it for the time being. Okay. So I'll untap one permanent. Mesmeric Orb will make an email. Oh, Liliana of the Dark Realms. Could have used that. Could have used her last game. <laughs> I could have used her last game. The <laughs> well, last you know, game, I just needed islands. I didn't yeah. need swamps. So Now, does she search for basic swamps or just swamps? Search your library for a swamp card. Okay. So swamp card. Was, so do you have, like, the I do. island yes. swamps? So you could have used her last game. That's fair enough. I could have. So... Let's think for a second. What you want to do? do, 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 do. <laughs> uh, Tell you what, I'm going to roll him down. I'm going to kill him off. Kill him. To draw two cards. And make things cost make less. Make things cost less. Is it two less? Uh, two less. Okay. So he did. And too bad he can't be planeswalkers. Uh, that would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. I will play another land for turn. Okay. And hmm. I think I'm gonna wait till your turn. Go ahead. All right. I forgot to do this last turn. What's that? We're going to tap uh, Spark Double and Sylvan Karyatid at the end of your turn mm -hmm. to play Once Upon a Time. One of another great card from Thrones of Eldraine. Uh, unfortunately, it just got, didn't it just get banned in, was it Pioneer, Pioneer or, or something? Um, so we're going to, if, uh, if this is the first spell, you can pack cast it for free. Uh, unfortunately, it's not. But look at the top five cards of your library. You may reveal a creature or a land card from among them and put it into your hand. The rest go from the bottom in any order. So, top five. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. You got a reveal? Uh... I may reveal a creature or a land Okay, card. gotcha. What do I want? Rogue's Passage Stand. Oh no, not Rogue's Passage. Oh, that's so. not a shuffle. That's up on the bottom. Okay. How, oh, oh, oh. How many are you milling? I'm, so that's what I'm doing. doing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's mill 10 cards. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Not the hinge. Ten. Any creatures? Uh. Rumatap Excavator. You may play land cards from your graveyard. Ah. And Multani. Oh, okay. So I will make Lazav copy Multani. Okay. Because it's land, right? Yep. Reach Trample. Multani. Uh, yeah, Naya's avatar gets plus one, plus one for each land you control and each land card in your graveyard. So that would make Lazav an 8-8 eight, eight with Reach, Trample, and Hexproof. Still has Hexproof? Mm-hmm. Okay. I'll take that. There you go. And you can change it whenever? Or is he Once that? something goes to the graveyard. Okay. All right, now I will draw a card. Ordain. I'm going to scry to anything interesting, anything exciting. Yes, that's spicy. Okay. Draw a card from pre ordain. Right. Then, plus for Nissa, reveal the top card. Black Blade Reforged. Ooh, that's pretty good. To hand. That's pretty good. One, her soul ring. Everybody loves a soul ring. Yep. Tap two for Black Blade. I like it. I like it. Cost seven to equip. Seven to equip Jeez. to a non-legendary. If it's a legendary creature. I could pay three to equip it. Oh, okay. All right. But um, I don't think I can target Dryad because it's got Lightning Breed. Well, I'm not sure how that works. Well, what I could do... You could move the Lightning Greaves Let's move off. the Lightning Greaves to Solemn. Okay. Responses? Um, yeah, sure. Okay. Let's... Let's Reality Shift... This green guy. All right, so what are we doing? Exile target creature. Its controller manifests the top card of his or her library. Okay, let's see. Do I have any responses? I do not. Okay, so exile? Exile. He really did. Did, did. All right, manifest top card. Mm hmm Okay. Well, then. Sorry, did I break your concentration? <laughs> no, that's okay. All right, move those there. Okay. We'll do seven on Solemn. All right. Because they have Defender and they can't attack. Yeah. So he is now a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He is a 10 10. Ooh. The swinging? Yep. Swinging for 10. I will pay one, two, three, four, two. Aetherize him and return him back to your hand. Okay. So he goes to hand. All right. Anything else? Uh, that will do it. All right. So at the beginning of my turn, I'll mill one, two, three, four, five, six because of Mesmeric Orb. So let's we'll see what we hit. Uh, Glimpse the Unthinkable. Scroll Rack. Vampiric Tutor. Sphinx's Tutelage. 
to snap cast your mage and traumatize. Hmm. Hate to see those go. That is a bummer. Come off the turn. Mine. Okay. Let's do. I'll pay two for Mind Crank. Okay. And. Let me see your graveyard. Nothing new in it. All right, instant. Let me see your instant sorceries. Uh, Mystic Dispute. Go get a land. Rapid Hybridization. Once upon a time. Ah, that's all right. Don't worry about it. All right. Urban Evolution. Draw three. Extra land and ponder. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, end of your turn. I'm just going to look at how expensive those six... At the end of your that turn. That was an expensive meal on myself. Yeah. Go ahead. I'm going to tap uh, Sylvan Carrieted and Spark Bubble. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to return two force mm -hmm. to my hand. All right. What do you got? To return Multani from my graveyard okay. to my hand. So it's uh, green and a colorless return two lands you control to their owner's hands return Multani from your graveyard to your hand cool all right all right how many we milling one two three four five six seven eight nine ten again all right one two three four five six Seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> yes. Don't you want your Lazav to be a Birds of Paradise? I mean, yeah. all right. Land for turn. Tap and six for Multani. Right. Tap and three for Black Blade. Seems good. Moving Lightning Greaves. Seems good. All right. So he is a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten, eleven, twelve. Either twelve. Twelve, twelve. No, twelve, twelve. Mm -hmm. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Nineteen, nineteen. Nineteen, nineteen. With the haste assets. Haste. And shroud. Got trample reach. Mm -hmm. Let me count. Let's see how much I would take. What did I say? Nineteen. Yep. So if I let it go through, that'd be eleven. Or if I blocked with him, that would be eleven trampling over. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna block with him. Yep. So eleven goes through with the trample. Mm -hmm. So that will put me at uh, twenty nine. All right. Okay. Uh, and then uh, we'll tick up Nissa. Mm -hmm. Goes to it's a land. Goes on to the battlefield. All right. I'm gonna let Lazav go to the graveyard actually. Really? Yeah. Nope. So go ahead. 
All right, I'm going to mill one for Mesmeric Orb. Ugh. Just gave me a symmetry. That would have been nice. Good card. So. Hmm. One, two, three. I'm gonna mill myself out before this is over with. Five, <laughs> six. I'm gonna cast Teferi. Very nice. What? OG Teferi Planeswalker. Still my, my favorite. Yep. My favorite Teferi. I'm going to minus him one to untap. Uh, four target permanents, so one, two, three, four. Okay. Um, can I play this one? I don't think I do. Hmm. Let's go one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine for Rise of the Dark Realms. Now, what are we doing? Put all creature cards from all graveyards onto the battlefield under your control. I don't think you're getting a whole lot from me. I'm not. I'm just looking for a couple of blockers. Oh, I really should not have cast every. I messed up. Snapcaster. Should you have waited? Should have waited. I should have. Should have played Rise of the Dark Realms first. That way I would have had the mana to cast something from Graveyard, but that's okay. No creatures in yours? I got four. Oh, okay. He's a zero one. A <laughs> zero one. A zero one Hydra. A zero two. A zero two. A zero one. <laughs> zero one. And a two three. And a two three. And you can play lands from your graveyard now. Oh, excellent. All right. That's all I got. That's all you got. That's all I got for this turn. So all right. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have to hope that you hit something really one, good for Lazar to turn into. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. What's the all promises? It is a six six with trample. Uh, okay, he'll just be a six six then. Or he'll, he'll copy the all promise. Yeah, okay. I don't think you get the destruction trigger. No, you don't sense. get to enter the battlefield. Look at that, you got about half of me right there. Just about. All right. All right, and then I'm going to draw for the turn. Play my land for the turn. Mm -hmm. uh, let's roll up Nissa. I like it. Vincer. I know where that's going. Where is that going? I suspect you're going to bounce something on my field with Vincer. Maybe this big freaking Hydra. <laughs> this colossal zero one Hydra that I have. Alright. Going to tap out. For 11. What are you doing? For a gen wave. Ah! Wait, wait. In response. Alright. I'm gonna. Narset's reversal that. Really? Mm. And that goes. You're gonna copy it. I get to copy it, but it puts your copy back in your hand. Okay. Do I have any? Not have anything for that. <laughs> All right, how many? What am I getting now? Uh, Eleven. That's totally gonna whiff. There's yeah. a, this is mostly instance of sorceries. So, yeah, so it's eleven. Uh, eleven top eleven cards. All right, so one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven. All very useful things. Yeah. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I got one, two, three, four lands, a mana rock, Mirko Boss, Jace's Archivist, and Leyla on the Void. And these go to Graveyard? Yes. Okay. 15. And I think that... 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Before you go to combat, let me know. 25, 26, 27. Before combat. Okay. Before combat. So either 27. 27, 27. We're going to break out the golf ball. I'm going to pay one, two. Or we're not going to use the three, golf ball because I can't find it. <laughs> four. I'm going to cast Reigns of Power. Okay. What does that do? Untap all creatures you control and all creatures target opponent controls. Uh -huh. You and that opponent each gain control of all creatures the other controls until end of turn. Those creatures gain haste until end of turn. All right, so we basically switch. Yes. Okay. Do they get haste? Uh, yes, they get haste. All right. So you have... Um, Do they untap? Yes, yeah, they untap and get haste. So, let's right. see. So we'll, let's just keep them where they are. Yep. Okay. You only get the mana rock out of the way. Untap, untap, untap. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. So, whenever a permanent becomes untapped, we have to mill. So, right, what I'm did un you... I'm untapping two. All right, so you mill two? Yep. And then I untapped uh, the Birds of Paradise. Yep. There goes Mystical Tutor. And then... Um, Creatures. All right, so I will swing in. That's a six six. Yes. Swing, 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 and you have to mill through four lands. Yes. Um, but he has reach. Yep. Let me think for a second. Okay, is it on swing or is it on combat damage? You got to do combat damage. Okay. So when you swing. Okay, I'm going to block the. It's hard because I'm looking at your board upside down. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Do we need to switch where we are? Would that help? No, 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 no. Okay, okay. So you've got one, two, three, four blockers. How many attackers? You've got one, two, three, four, four five. five. So that's six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, so I'm going to uh, block this guy with your Sylvan Carriage. Okay. So that will die. It goes exile because the, of Leyline of the Void. Yes. The Snapcaster Mage that you're swinging at me. 2-2. Uh, two, 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 it's a 2-2. Two, two. And that is a 1-4. Oh, because it comes in with a uh, okay. counter on it. All right, so I will let the Snapcaster uh, block that. Okay. And then that leaves uh, Chase's Archivist. So you block with the Snapcast or with the Smart Yeah, Apple. yeah, okay. So that. And what did you block this with the Sylvan Carry to? What, oh, you blocked that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. So then that leaves the, is, what is that, a 2 2? That's a 2 2. Okay. Um, I'll let 2-2 two, two block the excavator. So it'll so die. So this dies. So that let's dies. see what it was. It was a blanks. Okay. It was an exile. That leaves Mirko and the archivist. Um, I'm going to let those uh, go through. So I'll take four and have to mill till I hit four lands. So, one, two, oh, back, back, back. So, one land. Oh, uh, not an 
Yoshi. Yeah, okay. Two lands. Three lands. Four lands? Yep, four lands. Okay. Um, that's it, right? Yep. And it's just still in the turn, right? Just till in a turn. Okay. Uh, that is it. Okay, so I'll have to untap and mill one, two, three, four. Five, oh, how are you untapping? Six, oh, yeah, because that's one with him. Five, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. I'm milling 18. 18. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. I don't. I'm trying to think what really good mill spells I have <laughs> left. There's not a lot of them left. Yeah. So. But I will say this game is going a little bit better for you. Where's my hand? I don't know. Did Did you have a hand? I think. I guess I didn't. Uh, So you're top decking. I'm top decking. Okay, well, let's do this. I'm going to pay a one and tap Jace's Archivist. We're gonna discard our hands. Okay. How many cards you got? One, I mean, Eight. A, oh, that's wonderful. Let me see what creatures you got. No, they're going into oh, exile. That's right. All right, so you got eight, so we both draw eight. Yep. One. Actually, it should be seven. I meant to okay. discard down, so Two, seven. Three, four, five, six, seven. All right, I'm going to play land for turn. Okay. And then the second land because of the ramming up excavate. No. Uh, you may play land. Oh, from, from your, your graveyard. graveyard. Let's see. Sorry about that. Uh, okay, land from graveyard. All right. Take the. Did you take the one back that you played? I think it was a swamp. It was a swamp? Yeah. Okay. We're very casual here. Yeah, so. man. Sorry. Too much going on. Yeah. And All this right. is only our third video that we've ever made like this, so. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here All we right. Go. What you got? Big money. Uh, let's see. I'm going to, first of all, first of all, no, I can't because he has lightning greaves on. Yeah. I'll tell you what. I'm going to pay blue and then black and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I'm going to put eleven into. Ah, I've been missing these landfall triggers from the head right there. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm putting 11 into mine grind. All right, so 11. you will have to mill until you hit 11 lands. And that might do it for me, folks. Because I don't have a response to that. Yeah. No, I don't think I've got 11 more lands. One, two, three, four. Oh. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. <laughs> well, that works out perfect. <laughs> and those all go into exile. They all go into exile. And, um, yeah. Seems good. I'll tell you what, how many flyers have you got? You got one thing with reach? One thing with reach. I'm going to swing in the air with Mirko Vosk. Just to be me, you're zero one birds of paradise. All right. 
that. I'll smack the Marco boss down. Fair enough. <laughs> so your bird is just bumping into yeah, you. Bonk. Just bumping into it's you. It's like a bird when it hits the window. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. And then uh, I right. will pass turn. All right. And then I'm going to draw right off of this exit <laughs> pile. All right. So it took three games. Three games. It took me but, getting a little bit of mana. Yes, a little bit of mana to keep Tulane under control. And so how many would you have had to mill from Mesmeric or all of it? You're super dead, One, right? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven more. So I am super more. mill dead. All right, well. Um, and then in hand, some more land, the Bear Umbras, Sun Titan. Nice. All right. So we'll give Jacob the one victory today. One out of three one ain't bad. One out of three ain't bad. One out of three ain't bad. Yeah. So we hope that y'all have enjoyed this video. Uh, give us a like. Give us a subscribe at Blue Collar. Use your hand Andy. sanitizer. Don't forget your hand sanitizer. Make sure you have plenty of limes to go with that coronavirus. And y'all have a fantastic day. Y'all keep gaming.